Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Today we are taking a look at another set of character challenges in the Summer Days event. This time it is for the Scientist, which I'm pretty excited for because I just haven't been playing too much Scientist recently. He's a very good class, especially with the Steam Scientist upgrade, so this will be fun. As you can see, there are five Scientist challenges. Heal allies with Healing Hose, earn experience with Scientists, deal primary weapon damage, oh boy, revive allies, and vanquish heroes after using warp. So out of all these, I feel like this one specifically might take some effort, but you know, these don't seem too bad. I think we're gonna focus on healing allies with the healing hose as like our first thing, um, just to get that out of the way. And also there is a daily challenge of vanquishing heroes as a scientist. We'll be getting that done at the same exact time. So yeah, there's a lot of cool stuff as the scientists will be doing today. So let's go ahead and get started. Okay, so let's get started with this. Like I said, mostly focused on healing allies with the healing hose. Now with that, I don't know how that works with overhealing. Okay, so overhealing does count, and we can also heal this guy up, so hopefully we just get right to it and overheal as many people as we possibly can. Whoa, watch it for the cactus. Um, we should be able to get that 1,000 healing without too much of an issue. Um, the only thing I have to worry about is getting vanquished along the way, so let's try to put a stop to that. Definitely, the more health they have, the more health can be overhealed, right? So we wanna keep up with that and just try to keep behind this person. If I can throw out some damage here and there, probably a good idea so that I can keep myself alive as well. Oh, hello, Nightcat. I was just playing as you last episode. Ah, uh, leave me alone. Okay, so I am playing very defensively as a scientist right now, which should mean that I can survive for a good chunk of time and just really heal people up. I'm not gonna be focusing too much on damage in case, you know, bad things start happening. Oh no, like this is a decent time because they're sort of preoccupied anyway, so I can get some good damage out. Okay, back over this way. Ooh. And we're already halfway there, wow. Yeah, we're zooming through this. This is gonna be easy. Honestly, not too worried about many of these challenges at all. Okay, I definitely want to heal him up more way than one, more ways than one, because uh, he's suffering a bit. Can't heal myself too much right now. Okay, throw that damage out, throw that steam out. We got it. Already almost at 900. Oh, hello. No! <laughs> I should have thought about that. Whoops. Okay, well, it's fine. It looks like I joined this round really late too. As you can see, we only have 15 seconds off to capture the village, so let's get over there and help him out. I had thought that I joined right at the beginning. I guess I was wrong. Um, come on, come on. Let's throw a heal over like that. Get on over onto the point, over heal who I can. Oh no, sir, you need to leave. Oh boy. Let's revive quick, because that's another thing I do need to do if I get the chance is just to revive and I miss my opportunity. Uh, Cause we need 15 revives throughout this um, set of challenges. So we'll be trying to get that now. If it doesn't work out, it doesn't work out. And it looks like, Oh, the overtime is ticking down. Come on, I can at least overheal people. Get this first challenge done like nothing, right? Uh, ooh, keep going, overheal you a little bit. Not even overheal, just normal healing. Okay, then we don't even have to worry about the challenge anymore. Let's get out here and do some damage. That's our next goal. Oh no, don't you dare, <laughs> don't you dare. Come on, keep that overtime going. I tried to press the triangle button, it didn't quite work. Oh boy, but we're getting vanquished in the grave. I'm hoping that somebody's extending it, but maybe not. Oh, okay, there it is. But even though overtime is going, we're not capturing any of the point, and I think it might be a little too late this time. No, we still got it, okay. So it's a little bit too on the nose right now to, uh... oh, okay, there we go, they won. I was gonna say, a little just like too intense to track our next challenge. But I know that the next thing we're focusing on is probably just dealing damage with the primary weapon, which we di definitely did there. We did a little bit of primary weapon damage. We'll continue that in the next jump, but that was an excellent start. So here we go again. I was so into the action, I forgot to customize the scientist, so we're gonna be doing that in just a moment. But as you can see, healing allies with the healing hose, we got it done. Let's deal some primary weapon damage down. If we see anybody um, to revive, we'll do that. Like I said, really the Vanquishing Heroes after a warp is probably gonna be the one that takes us the most time. But for right now, let's respawn real quick so that we can customize the scientist and then we'll get right into the action. We are defending this time, so I don't really know how that's gonna work in terms of getting primary weapon damage, but we'll find out. Uh, ooh, that's a pretty cool Spectrum hat, the Bookworm. I don't think I've done this one. Changes the color of the worm. We do all that. We'll just do the normal pink though. I think that looks nice. And, ooh, I like those. I'm just trying to get into this quick. Uh, no, wrong button. <laughs> this is not very fast. Oh, we gotta do those. The pink foot and the big lips. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, very crazy looking character we got here. Let's get to it and see what we can get done. So it looks like a 
plenty of zombies are moving out there. I'm just trying to catch up for right now. And also, if we can get an additional 10 vanquishes throughout today's episode, that is for the daily challenge. And I'm sure we can get that done. Okay, this guy doesn't even see me. Oh, I don't know if that counts as a vanquish after warping, because it technically was after warping, but who knows. And doing primary weapon damage to the plants, or the, the spawnable plants as well counts, so trying to work on that. Oh my, let's try to heal you up a little bit. I got you, let's back it up. I still gotta do my duties as a scientist if I can, if the Snapdragon doesn't destroy me. <laughs> oh boy. Oh, will they revive me in return? I don't think so. Okay, we're just gonna keep going. It's a bit of a long walk for this first point, so definitely worth it just to do our best to get out there. They're halfway through right about now. Oh, and somebody can get revived, so you better believe. I'm going to try to revive them without getting destroyed. Ah, come on, come on. There it is, there it is, there it is. Excellent. <laughs> it wasn't much, but okay, you can heal me in return, right? No, I'm still, I'm, please. <laughs> I was hoping for a little return of the favor. There we go, thank you. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, hey, it happened eventually, right? Oh, don't you dare. I know you're here, I see you. But I can't quite get you, you're too quick. Don't you dare, I'm gonna get you. I'm trying to attack you, but I gotta reload. <laughs> there we go! Okay. Let's toss some stuff out there. A bit of a risky spot to do some revives out, so. Okay, watch it. Oh no. Sunflower's over this way. I don't know if there's too much I can do, but I'm trying. Now might be a good time to reload. Thank you, I appreciate it. It's two scientists against one sunflower. We can get her. Though, if I don't do that. Okay, play it safe. Plenty of other people to vanquish. Like this Snapdragon. They must have changed, because I feel like it actually is doing less damage than what I remember. But maybe that's just me misremembering. Oh, you're back. Hello, sunflower. No, that's still a lot of damage, isn't it? Ah, oh, but I gotta reload. Oh my, watch out for the cactus. There are several sunflowers with the same costume on. Whoa, okay. People getting vanquished everywhere. Come on, keep at it. Keep at it, one more shot. One more shot is all I need, please, thank you. Oh my gosh. Yeah, there's a lot of like similar characters. <laughs> multiple red snapdragons, multiple sunflowers. Oh my. It's another red snapdragon. <laughs> no, okay, that guy's not red. It was just so hot, I couldn't tell. Um, one more vanquish now, and then this daily challenge is out of the way, and that'll just get us a prize bulb, but it's worth getting. I mean, when it comes to levels for scientists, we're still trying to master him. He's at super elite level seven, so if we could get him to level eight today, that'd be you know, a good nudge in the right direction. Oh boy. But so far, yeah, the, the challenges have actually been going quite well. Just whatever I've been focusing on has been getting done quite quickly. I can only hope that continues. Cool, let's definitely get you. Whenever I do see the chance for a revive, I'm just trying to take it. Come on, I got gotcha. you. Ooh, I don't know if that counted as a vanquish after a warp, because it was technically um, a vanquish, but it was on a spawnable. Oh my gosh, we got gotcha. you! Wow, I can't believe that one. We do get a, uh, oh, that was the primary weapon damage. No, it wasn't. It said it was a character challenge. I don't think it was. Let's let's play it safe here. Ow, fire, hurts. Come on, come on. Almost got you. I'm trying to revive these guys. There's actually two of them here we can revive. At the same time we're juggling. Ooh, there's one. Can we get the other? No, I think they gave up. Ah, oh, darn. I'm getting stuck on the barrel. No, and then the game lags and I can't, couldn't sprint. Great. Okay, so let's get back out here. They are Getting closer and closer, but I think we can hold them off a little bit. Let's heal up that space station if I can. It's going pretty well. Um, yeah, it seems like they're having a hard time progressing after this point. We only have a little bit more damage left to do. Oh my. Oh no, oh, oh, he went for me that time, yikes. Not good. Uh, will they revive me at all? I think he actually got the other scientist, probably not. Oh boy. 45 seconds remaining. Like, our team is doing great at defending. Somehow I'm healing a critical ally still. Like, there's this constant experience flowing in. Well, how is that happening? Did I spawn something in that's healing? Or is that just like the game 
Did I do this Dr. Heals? I don't remember doing this Dr. Heals. Uh, okay, why did I throw the heal at the enemy? <laughs> Luckily, he doesn't actually heal them, but. Oh my, back it up, back it up. I just want to survive this. So they're really trying hard to take it now. Heal the Dr. Heals, <laughs> it's the only way. Here we go, get the rose a little bit. That was pretty good. Still backing it up though, we're at full health now though. I just had to reload. Oh, we got gotcha. you. Oh no, oh, hello, <laughs> well, that was awkward. Okay now, but that's another character challenge completed, but that's not the one I thought it was. <laughs> Which one is that? We'll have to find out in a moment. But it looks like we're, we're getting rid of their overtime, we might be able to get a win here before the, the primary weapon challenge is done. <laughs> come on, come on, oh, let's get a revive on you. Super quick, super quick. Hopefully faster than the overtime takes down, please, please. Okay, it still counts, awesome. So there's one more for us. All right, challenges are storming through even faster now, so we'll keep at it. And hopefully this third round will get the rest of them done. Okay, so let's see how far along we are in the challenges, as you can see. Yeah, it was going off a lot, but I mean, not quite there, but we are almost here. So we earned experience with the scientist there. Um, deal primary weapon damage, almost done. And then Vanquish Hughes after using warp is actually getting done really quick. We need to do that one more time. I think somebody's saying hello. <laughs> hey. <laughs> All right then. So uh, yeah, we'll just stick with people and we will just try to revive because that's actually the one we're the most behind on. Oh, I didn't know what they were gonna say, but they sort of held on to it. Thanks. You're welcome. Okay, so yeah, let's definitely try to you know keep up with everybody. Heal who we can, do some extra damage. Damage should be quite easy. I would hope. <laughs> we'll find out. Oh my, oh, okay. Let's not be a part of that one. Oh boy. So this point, the starting point might be a little bit tricky. Come on, get this, get this. Ah, oh, it didn't quite work. I don't think that'll count for the challenge. I probably shouldn't try to force it too much. If we've gotten nine out of 10 of them without me even specifically trying to do it, I think the last one will probably come quite naturally as we're just jumping in and out of action to get vanquishes and stuff. But yeah, I was surprised with how approachable and easy the 80s action hero challenges are. It's seeming like the scientist challenges are even easier so far. So like, that's really cool. Um, I'm, I know that some people want their challenges to be really challenging, but for me, I just, you know, I wanna, you know, do specific things with characters and then be able to move forward. Okay, let's go ahead and quickly get a revive for you. Hopefully none of them will notice because there's an acorn right here. Okay, you know what, we're going for him. We're going for him. There we go, I don't know if that'll count. I got a prize bulb, but not a character challenge. Oh, there it is, awesome. So it just took a second. So as you can see, yep, yeah, it's done. So just get some damage in just a little bit more and also try to revive. Oh, not too bad. I hear a chomper, but I don't see a chomper. That's the bad combo. <laughs> There's a nightcap over this way we can get. Oh, gotcha, and there it is. Awesome. Let's see if I get in trouble for this. <laughs> I might, uh, just hold on tight. There it is, <laughs> I survived. Wow. Oh no. Okay, he got me, that's fine. Yeah, I'm just all in with revives now. If I see somebody knocked out, I'm just gonna revive them. Risk it all for it. So let's make sure we're tracking that challenge just so it's easier. Uh, because we're more than halfway there now. That's good. And it seems like there were other scientists on our team that are probably also helping with revives and stuff. But yeah, this is actually one of the few times we'll be getting all the challenges done in one episode. I think that's only happened once, maybe twice before. I mean, that's assuming that I get these revives, which I should be able to. We're still pretty early in today's episode. Oh no. I hear a chomper once again, I don't see him. Okay, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Run, run. Oh, I was gonna revive somebody, but I guess they're gone. Okay. No, 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 no. <laughs> don't know where that was coming in from. Let's get this guy real fast. Oh, I couldn't. And that's where just, there's maybe some time to focus on vanquishing them so that they don't vanquish me while I'm reviving, but it can be tough to balance. But since I haven't asked you guys yet, what are your thoughts on these scientist challenges so far? Were you able to get them all done like I seem to be able to so far? Um, did you think they were too challenging, not challenging enough? I always love to hear about your thoughts on that and any strategies you use to get them done. 
it's always good. I think that the challenges will be easier from here on out. Maybe even if the challenges themselves are tougher than they have been now, the fact that we have private play should make a lot of the challenges a lot more approachable to complete. Oh boy, I don't know where the nightcap is, but oh my, Chomper is chasing me down. Let's get rid of that healing. Oh. Okay. Ah, uh, this is bad. <laughs> I was just hoping they'd ignore me for long enough. But that's just sort of the risk you run. Trying to revive people in the middle of the point. I think the next point, if we can actually capture it, we'll have to wait and see. It's been a lot of quick rounds so far today. Um, but we'll have to wait and see if uh, on the second point, I think it'll be a bit better because it's a lot more stretched out while this area is a bit more condensed. I mean, I suppose. There are parts of this area that are pretty stretched out, but other parts, not so much. Okay, I see you over there, I gotcha. And even though I'm supposed to be reviving them, if I can help them stay alive, I should. Okay, there's a chomper coming. Didn't quite get me there. No, now he did, but I did get the revive. That's all I wanted. Excellent, the zebra chompers are just running around. You know, they make me proud, but at the same time, <laughs> they're chomping me. <laughs> that shouldn't be allowed. Oh well. There we go, the team captured the point. That's fantastic. We're a little behind right now. But we'll catch up. Somebody over there needs our help. Can we get there in time, though? No. Here we go. Here's a heal. Yeah, it looks like we weren't able to. Okay. But yeah, I think that there'll just be a lot more opportunities to revive from a distance here. So let's first, ow! Wow, they really went for me there. My gosh, there were way more plants than I was anticipating. Oh boy. Can you guys get out of our spawn? We gotta keep going. Oh wow, we're way back here too. So not the best start to capturing Unotako. But honestly, if we don't capture it and all we do is get revives, like that's fine with me too. And if we have any extra time, by the end of today's episode, I'll probably just focus all in on vanquishes and stuff, so. Who else is, is people are still getting taken out around here. This is weird. Come on, I gotcha. Then over here, same deal. They really shouldn't be vanquishing us this close to our spawn, but it's what's happening. Okay, just three more. That really isn't that bad. Couple of zombies up this way need our help. Probably because of that kernel corn. Oh boy. Don't you dare. Leave him alone. Ow, they, he almost got me. There we go. I can heal up no problem now. So I'm just trying to pay attention to where my team is going and follow them as much as I can. Oh, where are you? I got gotcha. you. Wait, no, come back. Where did she go? <laughs> okay, you know, I'm just gonna go down there and join her. Might be a little bit more risky up here, but we got plenty of people we can heal, so that's good. And we get lots of experience from it. We're level seven right now, like I said, I'm still trying to get the level eight. I don't know if that's gonna happen at this point. Oh no, you don't. Get out of here. Well, here comes Nightcap. Somebody got her. Oh, the Snapdragon's coming in too. I'm not gonna be able to uh, revive the guys that are in a more risky position though. Okay, I don't think they see me. And they get over here real fast. Come on, no! I'm getting stuck on the, on the spike weed. Come on, I just wanna revive. They don't notice me, they don't notice me. This could be my second to last one right here. Wait, no, he revived, or he respawned, or whatever. Not good. Where did that come from? Oh, over here. There's too many, there's too many nightcaps. There was at least three of them. Oh my gosh, come on. This is a bit of a bad situation, but we'll keep at it. We still have three minutes, so there's plenty of time to turn it around, turn it into a good thing. Oh, that guy was flying. Hmm. And the zombies are taking the point as well. I don't know why I'm going out here. This is too risky. There's no revives to be had over here. Um. Okay, once again, get rid of the nightcap. Can I help with reviving you? I would hope so. Excellent. Just one more is all I need. Whoa, he just popped up right in front of me. Oh my gosh. And and they actually got me with it too. 
Hmm. Oh, they're reviving me. Returning the favor. How courteous. Oh no. <laughs> Let's revive the revivers. I'll heal you up as soon as I can. And there we go. All the scientist ca ch character challenges completed in one episode. That's really exciting. So we get an additional five bulbs on top of the two or the five bulbs we get for each challenge. So that's cool. We're up to 19 bulbs right now. I'll keep working. I think we could definitely get to our 20th if we just keep getting out there, get more vanquishes, all the kind of stuff. I haven't gotten too many. I got 10, which is okay. Oh, you're in trouble. <laughs> you're in big trouble. Okay, let's keep it moving. Oh, you need some heals. I don't know if that actually reached him or not, but I tried. And I hear nightcaps and stuff making big problems. Come on, I gotta reload. <laughs> oh boy. Can we spawn in the healing guy? I mean, I could. No, no, wait, wait, wait. I panicked there a little bit. Ah, oh, and they still got me. Why are there so many plants by respawn this round? They are just really going at us. But luckily, the zombies are being very supportive as teammates. I appreciate that. There we go. Yeah, let's spawn some stuff in if we can. Oh no, big problems. Everybody hang out near this little heal bubble. We have so many super brains. They have a bunch of nightcaps. We have a bunch of super brains. Which one is gonna win? I mean, when it comes out, muscling them. We already know. But when it comes to being a bit more tactical. <laughs> they might have the advantage. Oh gosh, I'm burning away right now. Or I'll heal you up in the meantime though, if I can. So, let's try to sneak around this corner a little bit. I don't see any plants around, so it might be a good opportunity just to take it. <laughs> that super brain is way up on the tree. There we go. Oh no. Nightcaps are just running around so much, it'd be hard to hit them with a the seam. Definitely take this chance to reload. Oh, get out of here, thank you. There's a prize bulb. That's what I was looking for. Healing up these guys as much as I can. Oh man. Okay, okay. Got you a little bit there. Don't you dare, I'm not gonna let that happen. Mm-mm, very nice. And you don't even seem to be <laughs> looking over here, so might be able to get you. Okay, one more shot is all we need. Maybe. Oh, run, run, run. Come on. Gotcha. Times four vanquish streak looking really good. Ooh. This oak does not see me. But he's he's moving a little too quick for me, apparently. Don't you do that! Uh... No. Mm -mm. Oh my gosh, I needed one more teleport. The nightcaps are teaming up with each other. One nightcap is tough enough, but two or three of them? I don't know if I can handle that. We haven't even captured any of this point either. Hmm. Let's spawn in some extra health if we can. That does make a big difference for a point like this. Okay, you don't see me. Colonel Corn is, once again, very distracted. I don't know what he was looking at, but it must have been interesting. The only problem with the Steam Scientist is that it just has very low ammo. I swear it didn't have as much low ammo before, but maybe I'm misremembering. But maybe they did nerf it a little bit. And wherever I go, there's a nightcap waiting. Are they chasing me? Not for right now. Oh, hello. Don't you dare. I, I gotta change up my, oh, did he fall? He fell. I have to change up my strategy a bit. I feel like they're uh, expecting me. But this guy certainly doesn't see me, right? Okay, he's just running away though. Doesn't even wanna deal with that. Oh, the steam from up here stacking up the vanquishes. Oh no, they gotta be taking notice any second now. And if she doesn't move from that steam, it will get rid of her. Oh, hoo hoo hoo. No, 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 hold on, <laughs> that's fine. That was quite the vanquish streak we had going on there for a little bit. Well, let's get back out there as soon as we can, because we still have not captured any of it. I feel like that's what I gotta help out with more, is just getting the people on the point off of there. And I'm trying to, it's just really tough point, really, really tough. 
Okay, heal who I can. We got more support out here, it looks like. With the wizards and stuff. Oh, don't do that. Okay. Because if I go in there, I get vanquished real quick. We need to sort of go around the side and get immediately vanquished. I thought I was gonna reach farther. I guess it doesn't. Okay. I don't know if we're gonna make it. If we don't though, so be it. It's been a great episode nonetheless, but I would love to make it to the final point, the final round. We'll have to wait and see. Okay. No! This pea shooter's been jumping everywhere and it certainly doesn't make it any easier. He's good. <laughs> He's got some accuracy. We're starting to contest it a little bit. Because any amount captured right now is preferred. I'm just trying to stay back. They're all damaged when I need it. Do not get vanquished by a Gatling pea shooter. Oh no, it's overtime. I'm trying to reload and heal as much as I can. I see that nightcap. They're making it so difficult for me right now. Come on. My goodness. Oh, here we go. Oh, you're in trouble. Gotcha. Ooh. Ah, ha, ha, ha. The plants are just too defensive right now. I don't think we can break through this. Is anybody extending that overtime right now? Looks like an imp just jumped on and a super brains. Because I just don't have the chance to like revive or anything. But ooh, an all-star coming in. That might be good if he can get in there and set up his shield. It might hold them back for a bit. I'll throw up a heal as soon as I can. I think that just hit a pea shooter, and it's too late. Overtime ran out. So, yeah, that was still a lot of fun. Pretty quick rounds today, but we were able to get, of course, um, quite a lot done. We were able to get all the scientist character challenges done. So we'll go and spend some uh, prize bulbs back at Giddy Park. So there were all of the scientist challenges and getting them all done in one episode is very uncommon for us. And we almost did the same thing with, like I said, the uh, 80s action hero. So we'll see how the Citron and Pea Shooter challenges stack up. Will they be just as easy? We'll have to find out. But for right now, as you can see, we have 20 prize bulbs to spend and we're almost done with this prize map. Like we're getting through it pretty quick. We got the heels over there, expression, and then up this way, we have the Go Fish Common Punchers. So we're just gonna keep working over this way a little bit to get that one chomper costume. But next episode, we'll be checking out the uh, cactus uh, item set. But there is another victory slab. And that leaves us with, oh gosh, <laughs> some free rainbow stars and I'll have to earn up an additional 11 rainbow, or not rainbow stars, but uh, prize bulbs to get this uh, chomp night. We'll get it soon though, that'll be fun. But for right now, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Plants vs. Zombies Battle for Neighborville. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time, bye bye.